at least this is loading up quicker. I will definitely say that. They actually improved the um, speed time of the loading time on this. I know a lot of the stuff that I said in this video probably sounds repetitive from what I said from the other ones, but this is just me just sort of like giving little reminders and saying about my honest opinion, really. But that's not me hating on the game. This is me just actually basically giving an honest opinion. I do actually like the game. I think it's wonderful to play as. And it's good to get involved and such. But I will definitely say, you know, look before you buy sort of thing. It is good. I would definitely say, in my opinion, it is worth me buying. But that's just me. But at the same time, I will say, look before you buy and see what you think. Because it might not be for everyone. There you go. That's the words I was looking for. It might not be for everyone. Anyway, let's see if I can actually survive in this one. Grow up into an adult. I probably won't. It's nice that I'm a blue colour, actually. Ooh! I still grow in this one, too. I look like a fat little thing as well. I gotta say, the blue colour looks pretty cool. Yeah, I do. I do have a bit of um, a thing for blue and green. Even though this one's like completely blue, but you know, blue and green is my two favorite colors. So that's why I'm like, ooh, I like it. Now, where's the darn food on this server? Or is there none? Oops. Not... Well, you got stamina. You got. Oh, my hunger is. Oh. Right, now I get you. Makes sense. Alright, let's see if I can actually find any food. I doubt that I can, because I don't know where everything is here. I also noticed people took an interest in the Beast of Bermuda video as well, which I'm very grateful for and such. I will admit, um, these kind of games like Beast of Bermuda and Day of Dragons and even Path of Titans and all the other games, I do play, but it's kind of like now and then. It The main games I mostly play is Ark, Subnautica, Star Trek, or it'd be some other games that, you know... The usual type of games that I like to play, something with a bit of adventure, platforming, Sonic games, you know, this is me just basically telling you lot that these are the sort of games I would play on this ch channel, sort of like, there are other games that I usually play, so, yeah, so every now and then I do actually go back to these type of games just to, you know, play them, see if I can actually do a lot better, or see what's changed, see what's the gossip or whatever and such you know because i i don't want to actually just go and leave them just to collect dust and such like that i just want them to actually you know want to give them their full chance and such like that and you know keep on seeing what's changed and such like that and about um so far not much has changed and it's just um you know you still got the usual dragons and such but you know it's it's still nice to play and such and it's one of those little humble games to play and such uh which game would be best as i would say for me um the best one out of these like from dare dragons path of titans and um uh, what do you call it oh yeah piece of bermuda and the isle hmm which ones would be the best for me uh, I would definitely say I'm stuck between the R and Beast of Bermuda because I have fond memories of those two uh, with um, my friend Danny. And um, the reason why I say that uh, the R and Beast of, Bermuda, Beast of Bermuda and the R are my two top favourites is because of those memories I have, you know, it's like strong memories and such. So that's why they're like my top favourites. I guess it's more of a um what do you call it i guess it's a personal thing or something like that i was trying to think of the words there but yeah um 
Well, it's nice to see that you've got global chat um, active in this one. It seems that the US servers are a lot more active compared to the UK servers, which is actually pretty fine. It'd be nice to actually see this game get a lot more activity into it and a lot more um, done to it and such like that, so that it can become popular and such. But, like I said, you know, these these things take time and you know i'm not going to rush the this or go oh you know they should really do this and that because that's not what i'm about i mean i'm not going to stop people from actually saying it because everyone has their own opinion and everyone's entitled to own their own opinions and such like that because you know i respect that like i said before many times and i rather hear people's opinions because i rather hear them go you know say you know they didn't want to actually tell me that oh you know you should try this game or you should try that survival game and you know that's better than you know this game that game I, I don't mind hearing that sort of thing because uh, as long as it's said in the right way that's when i don't mind it. if it's said in the wrong way like in the like oh I, you know you shouldn't really be playing that game you should be playing this then that's when i'm like no nah, i don't take it serious if they actually say it in a more genuine um what the hell was that it does say it in a more suggest like as a suggestion or advice to say oh maybe you should actually try this game or maybe you should uh, try that game or to say oh i don't know maybe you shouldn't be playing this game if they say it in a polite way like in a correct like in a polite way and that then i'm more inclined to listen but if they say it in more of a rude way or more of a way of saying oh you shouldn't do that you should do this and that and then it's like no i'm i mostly listen to advice and you know Put it this way, politeness goes a long way. Put <laughs> it that way. But, um, yeah, that's for this game. I'm not going to be knocking it or anything like that. Cause, like I said, it's had a lot of knocks in the past. And, you know, I can understand why people would say the stuff, what they said. And, you know, I'm not going to say I disagree with them. Because I do agree with, you know, what some of the people have said. But at the same time, I'm also, you know, hopeful for this game. Um, and even the ones that I even said or even gave a bashing said um you know they're quite hopeful for the games and that not all of them but some of them i mean i have actually um, heard people give it really big slate and such like that and you know again i can understand why i'm not going to say oh you know they're wrong for giving it this and that because no because everyone's it's again it's everyone's entitled to you know say their opinion everyone's entitled to say what they feel and everyone's entitled to play what they want to play and that's what these guys in fact funny enough one of them uh, actually well actually more than one of them i've noticed that everyone that's gave this game um a bashing have actually said look i don't mind what you play if you want to play it, you can play it i respect that but f for me it's like it's not you know it's not the game for me it's this is more of my opinion. That's what a lot of people mostly said when they gave it a bash. And they always say, it's just a matter of my opinion. And you know what? I, every time when they actually said stuff like that and actually said, you know, play what you play and such like that, I've always respected those people for giving their strong opinions, no matter if it is bashing the game or, you know, whatever. Because they actually say it in a more respectable way. They say it in a way of like, yeah, I think this is like da 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 but if you play it, it's fine. I don't mind you playing it. It's just me, how I feel about it. That's, you know, and I respect them for that. For me, um, like I said, I'm... I actually like this game, I will say. It is a nice chill-out game. But it's not the game that I will play, like, on a daily basis. I will play it, like, um, every here and there, now and then, and etc, etc. So, yeah, it is one of those games that I would actually come back and play here and there, but not all the time, because, like I said... Games like this and such like that, I mostly play as a one-off thing or here and there. I mostly am playing things like Ark or um, Subnautica and all that stuff, you know, like I said. Um, if my friends were to go, oh, can you play this with me? Or oh, I'd like, like to, you know, you to play this with me. I mean, you can even make a video of it and such. I'll be like, hey, sure. I mean, even if they said, you know, I don't want a video played out of it, you know, I, I still would go, yeah, sure to it. Because who might say no to my friends, you know? Unless, of course, I'm not in the mood for it, but, you know. But, yeah, it's always it's always great to play this with your buddies and such like that. And I haven't found a single dragon. Hmm. 
but hey at least you know you heard my little uh <laughs> little opinions and little rattling on eh <laughs> uh, but if i do talk too much in the videos i apologize but then again why am i apologizing for talking too much <laughs> but no if i do actually talk too much or rabble on too much you know just you know i do apologize in advance but at the same time um if you feel it's a bit too much just you know let me know let me know what you want to see what, what you want to know and such like that and i'll see what i can do what the hell is that sound i think that was other dragons interesting i want to see this where do you eat? Queen of Dine. Yeah, that's a good question. I'd like to know where do you eat too? Where do you find water? Where do you find... A lot of things. Starlight slash Wormo. SSX for grabs. What? Are these places names or all the people names? Is there a map? No. Uh. Yeah, that's another thing I will say that could be improved on on this game is definitely food for the dragons. There should be a little bit more around and more drinking areas, but mm, it's still a work in progress. So, you know, it's one of those things. No, let's see if I can get to the point where there's more dragons because I'm pretty sure that I'm hearing sounds but not seeing any dragons now some my wall icons telling me that I'm thirsty Oh, I heard some dragons about. Like the famous explosions and such. I have to actually get with the whole what the SS means and all that stuff. Because it's like, I don't even know what the hell that means. You see, this is this is how rare I'd actually um, play this type of games. When I say rare, you look at my videos and think, hold on, hold the phone, rare? But you played this quite a lot. Now, that is true. You may see that on my YouTube, but I will say a lot of those are pre-recordings and sometimes I put them all together. So it looks like I'm playing a lot, but it's not. It's actually... Um, like every now and again and so i'm kind of like as they like to say a lightweight <laughs> a casual no not casual um is it casual or is it um no what's the one i'm looking for where a player just plays it once in a blue moon or something like that um no it's a regular if you play it constantly casual i guess would be the best i think it's casual i can't remember yeah either way you get what i'm trying to get say is that another dragon out there? Is that a dead body? Wait, is that food? Wait. Ah, blast. If only I had the ability to fly. Ugh. Patience. Might be some grass I saw. Yeah, it's probably grass. I thought it might be... No. Fudge. It's grass. Oh, I thought it might have been a dragon. Well. Wait a minute. That looks like a shape or something. Is there water nearby? And my food's going down. I'm probably not going to make it. 
Yeah, it's a it's a tree or part of the foliage. There we go. Oh well. Anyway, I think this would be a good time to call it a night. Because I think I've gone past the limit. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this little video. And I'm sorry there wasn't much action and such like that. And again, if my rambling on earlier or me, you know, going overboard with my chatting and that uh, got annoying, I apologise again in advance. But um, yeah, I'm just running out of ideas what to do on these type of games because it's like, yeah, I just don't know what to do at the moment. It's like, yeah, I can wander about and such that, but there's only so much I can do with that because it's like, hmm. But then again, maybe I'm getting a bit struck for um, ideas or something. Eh, who knows? Oh, wait. S is that something? Wait, I was going to call it a knot, but I'm going to actually see how far I go with this. I'm hoping there's food ahead. Might be just another bush. Hoping there's water. Wait, where there's water, there might be food. Hmm. Hmm. Eh, it's just a big rock. Oh well. No grub for me. And no water either. Well, that's a shame. But anyway. At least I've got to show you um, this and such like that. <coughs> Excuse me. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video that I've done so far. And again... If you want to see anything more like this or you want to see me do something, just let me know in the comments and such. Until next time, you'll, you'll take it easy and peace out.